Hey there, Julian from MemberStack here, and welcome to MemberScript 142. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can very easily and reliably embed a PDF on your Webflow page. So first things first, let me just show you how it actually looks. So here we are on this page, and as we can see, we have this PDF. It looks perfectly fine, looks good. We've got Zoom, we've got all of the standard stuff right from the browser. We can print it out, download it set it into two page view if we want, all of that kind of standard stuff live here on the page. And as you can see, we've got a nice little corner radius. There's a border, I don't know if you can see it. And uh, yeah, now if I go, for example, look at what this would look like on mobile. You have to refresh so it can re-render. As you can see, it is also responsive perfectly. People on mobile can still download it, print it, do whatever it is that they want to do. So with that being said, now let me go into Webflow and show you how you can make this work. So the first thing that you're going to do is add the script for member script 142. It looks like this. If you found this video on YouTube, go to the link in the description to go to the page and get the code. If you're watching this from the member stack site, then you've already seen the code. Add this to your page. Uh, do not add this site wide unless you need it on every single page of your site better to add it in the page. It's better for performance. It's better for everything. Um, so that is it. Just add in that code and then go to your asset panel and upload your PDF. So as we can see, I've got a couple PDFs in here. This is the one I'm using right now. Click the three dots and click copy link. Then what you're going to want to do is make a div. So as we can see over here, I have PDF underscore embed. That is my div. Um, and in the settings, I have two custom attributes applied. We have ms-code-pdf-src, and then that copied file link is what's right here. And then we have ms-code-pdf-height. So the reason for this is because the browser doesn't really automatically know what size the PDF should be. It doesn't have the power to read in it and understand that. So you kind of have to set a height to your PDF reader. So here I set it to 80 VH. You should be able to enter, you know, 20 VH, 5 VH, 1000 VH, 20 pixels, whatever it is that you want to do. Whatever height you want it to be should go in there. As for width, you can just style your container, set the width to 400 pixels, do whatever you want to do. And uh, as we can see here, I have my border set, I have my radius set, and I have it to overflow clip so that that works. So that is all you need to do in order to embed a PDF directly on your Webflow site. Super fast, super easy. If you have any questions, let me know in the MemberStack 2.0 Slack. Talk to you soon and have a great day.